Welcome to Watch, React, and Evaluate, Class of 24. Today we're taking a look at Taylor Tatum, the number one running back in the class. He is five foot ten and a half, two hundred 200 pounds, goes to Longview High School in Longview, Texas. He is a consensus four-star according to the On3 Industry Ranking, the number one running back in the class, and the ninth best player in the state of Texas. As you can clearly see, USC is in the lead at 22% according to the recruiting prediction machine. He has already taken his official visit to USC, but upcoming he has Oklahoma, Michigan, Georgia, Texas A&M, and Texas. Did Coach Lincoln Riley and USC do enough to get him to commit on his first official visit? Who knows, he's got five more left, but all that doesn't matter right now. What matters is you about to get WRE, my man, and rank. Let's get it. All right, Taylor Tatum, let's get this thing rocking. Junior season highlights, man. Let's go. See what this dude talking about. Number one running back. We're going to find out. 227 carries, 1,889 yards, 33 touchdowns. Yee! Uh, practice tape. Here we go. Mm, good jump cut right there. Let's go. Can you turn the corner on 16? Yes, sir. Outruns the angles. Like I say, 200-pound dude. Uh, look at this old power eye look, little outside zone. Let's talk about this look right quick. Mm, my man with the stinking block down here at the bottom. Oh, that's terrible. Oh, man, you had to do the man like that because you're getting whooped. Look at him. That's disgusting, too, on the white team. That's ugly, man. That's terrible. Good run, though, bro. I hate seeing bad football. Counter action, gap scheme. Mm, get some. That's what I'm talking about. Get behind these pads and give them one. Ski. Yes, sir. Get out of here, Timmy. I tried my best, coach. <laughs> Poor little Timmy moment right here, baby. Ski. Mm. Uh, that's what I listen. And that's a lost art when you talk about football today, man. Guys don't get behind their pads like they used to. All right, little wide receiver action. Oh, ugly corner out. I like it. I take it for the tub, though. It's interesting to see, man. Uh, you know, in Texas, they got very good football, but this coach decides to still run the old eye back, and I'm loving it. Love the power game, especially if you got a running back like this. Why not? Why not go ahead and use him to the best of his ability? He got some good cuts in him. You know, I don't know about from an explosion standpoint, as I see him in the in the hole, he does a good job uh, being agile in the hole, making quick cuts, making quick decisions. But I like this part of his game, especially. He can go out there and play wide receiver, you know, especially in special packages. Tall, sweet. Yeah, boy. When he get a straight line, you in trouble. When he gets straight line speed, you in trouble. Now, he does a good job in the hole you know making guys miss like right there good vision good speed you know once you get rolling you in trouble but i love the old school look man look at this old power let's go baby down block down block kick out here we go you got some trusty hands man the old throwback hey he come down with it like i say He's very interesting running back, especially in today's football. You don't see this kind of look. Great move right here. Look at this move. Right here, he sees it. 52, a little slow getting around the bend. But what I love about what he does, he stays right behind him. That forces the defender to come straight to the block. Then he's going to cut it uh, and get out there. Let's go. Holla at you. There we go. The big ugly's pulling around. Hold up, bro. I ain't, hold up, hold up. Did you just get tackled with a foot? Hold on, man. <laughs> I ain't never seen this. Uh, dude stepped on his foot and got tackled. Come on, Tatum. You got to get up out of there, baby. Man, big shout out to the blockers up front, man. They, hey, I hope you taking them boys to steak dinners. If you ain't never seen that old school, uh, um, Come on, man. Marshawn Lynch, when he was in high school, that boy said, I'm broke. I can take him to Sizzler. That's what you better do, man. Get them big boys up front getting it done for you. 
Oh my God. Look at the power. Look at his legs. Never stop moving. Look at that. Legs never stop churning. Like right here, technically, he could have put his foot in the ground and got outside. But hey, I'm going straight ahead, coach. I got to get this thing, man, for the tub. Shut up, Coach Hayes. I know what I'm doing. I'm going straight. He's got good balance. Oh my gosh. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about, baby. Yeah, his stop and go right here. This is a great play by him. Watch it. It gets kind of muddled, right? Kind of get ugly up in here. What does he do? Has he a little bit? Get behind his block. And that's what I think most important about his game. He gets behind the block. And the block is kind of like uh, stick to them guys. And then he makes his break and he hits the gas. Magnetize is the word I was looking for. This is the old, old school power, man, right? Look at this. Kick out block right here. Big boy pull around, seal this deal, right? It's not there. Bounce it outside. Keep working. Come on. If you outrun this dude, you got top end speed. Ah! And that's what I was worried about. I wasn't sure how fast he was. I did read something about a four or five, uh, you know, in some articles, but I don't know how fast he tops out at again. Four or five is not slow by any stretch of the imagination. I'm loving it. Great way to finish this thing off, man. Let's get into your rankings. Tell, tell Tatum, you are the number one running back in the country. I know your family, your school, and the community is super proud of you. Size, gold chip, 5'11", 200 pounds is a great size going into college. Size, gold chip. I saw you ran a four or five. I think that was electric time in there. Nothing wrong with that. That's great speed when it comes to a running back for the power five level. Effort, blue chip. My man, I love the way you run. You got an old school feel about you. Something I think is a lost art. You get behind your pads. You punish dudes when you have to, but you make them miss when you have to. And that's what I like about it. As I watched the entire tape, man, you stiffing guys out there using your free arm. You know how to cut back on different angles. And not only that, they got you doing everything. Got you at wide receiver, taking them deep, running the screen game, peel routes, balls out the backfield, and you're running different kind of things too. I'm loving it. Fundamentals and technique, gold chip. You're doing exactly what you're supposed to do at the running back level. Like I said, there are times that you make exciting plays. There's time that you see the hole and you know how to use your blocks. That's important. You get right behind your guys and the defense gets magnetized to the offensive blindman and it sticks to the block. Now you can break off. That's perfect. Intangibles, gold chip. I can tell right now, the team is on your back and there's nothing wrong with that. 270 something carries, eight over 1800 yards rushing, three touchdowns catching. I saw that man, but it goes to show that the team needs you. In order to win ball games, number two got to carry the ball. Overall, Taylor Tatum, you are a gold chip athlete when it comes to Coach Hayes football. Man, I'm super excited to follow your career again. Number one running back in this class. USC is leading the charge right now, but who knows where this young man will go. If you are a fan of USC, Michigan, Oklahoma, Texas, Texas A&M, or Georgia, I need you to rep your school while you hit that subscribe button and notification bell so you have all the latest content that comes on this channel. And Coach Hayes will catch you at the 50-yard line. Peace.